Hello everybody, welcome to Minutes with PJ. Today's day, June 26, 2016. It is Sunday. Our discussion today is going to be on Empowered. In Luke 10, 19-20, Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. In Acts 1, 8, But you shall receive power after the Holy Ghost in, is come upon you and you shall be witnesses unto me both in Jerusalem and in all Judea and in Samaria and unto the uttermost part of the earth. In 2 Corinthians 12, 9 And he said unto me, My grace is sufficient for thee, for my strength is made perfect in weakness most gladly, therefore, will I rather glory in my infirmities that the power of Christ may rest upon me. Titus 2.12 Teaching us that denying ungodliness and worldly lust, we should live soberly, righteously, and godly in this present world. 1 John 4.4 4, You are of God, little children and have overcome them, because greater is he that is in you, and he that is in the world. Defined here, empowerment is to give someone the authority or power to do something and make someone stronger and more confident, especially in controlling their life, claiming their rights. Jesus empowered the apostles with healing and power, over the enemy. Paul asked God to take a thorn from him three times. Each time God told him no and empowered him with the strength enough to complete his mission of sharing the gospel with Gentiles. When empowered, we will live a right life away from the lusts of the world. God is working in and through us when we are empowered. I want you to think about this today. Have a blessed day.